Jeez, Sonny, what did you eat? Oh, hey there, Kim. Oh, hey, friend. Whoa. You know, I bought too many mums. I just wanted to bring some over to you. Wow. Um, thanks. Aren't you so excited for fall? Where's your closest cider mill? Cider what? You know, a cider mill with apple cider and apple cider donuts. I have no idea what that is. Yeah, you do. It's a big red barn. It's got apple butter, caramel apples, apple jam, apple bread. How many things can you make from apples? Oh, the first day of fall should be right around the corner. Yeah, not quite. You know, I called my friend Charlie up north just to see if it's fall up there yet. Oh gosh, are your leaves changing colors? No, yeah. You or no? Yeah, no. Oh, you're kidding me. Yeah, no. Wait, yeah, no or no, yeah? Yeah, no, for sure. Well? Yeah, I suppose it's about that time. Yeah, I suppose. Goosey, look at them squirrels. Oh my gosh, Kim, look, your leaves are changing. No. I think they're just browning up from all the heat and dying. I mean... See, we actually have 12 seasons here in the South. Okay. Each individual season has several stages to it. Right. Right now, we're in Hell's Front Porch. Oh, yeah. Next week, we'll have False Fall, followed by Second Summer. Second Summer? Actual Fall is basically winter. So when is actual fall? Fall's usually just four hours on a Tuesday in late November. So should I put a date on my calendar or? So until then, just turn the thermostat down to 65, bundle up and pretend it's fall. That's what I do. Well, I'm sure by Halloween you'll at least need a coat. No, no you won't. You know, I still can't find a Halloween costume that'll fit over a sweatshirt for the kids. They won't need a sweatshirt. You know, last year little Mary had to wear a winter coat over her princess dress and she was pretty PO'd if you know what I mean. You're not gonna have to. And the year before the snow melted and then it refroze and she was falling up and down the neighbor's stairs. It snowed? I mean, thank God that Steve had some snow salt. Penn just used his table salt. Then the salt stained her mermaid tail and it was ruined. But you know, we had a really good time. That does not sound like a good time. Hey, do you think we should organize the chili cook-off for the neighborhood? Now? Yeah, you know, don't get everyone in the fall spirit. You know the forecast for the next three weeks is above 90 degrees, right? Steve makes a really mean chili. Chili's more of like a Super Bowl thing here. He's making a batch right now. Do you want to try some? Oh, no, 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 you don't have to. Hey, Steve! Here we go again. Can I tell Kim your secret ingredient for your chili? You want me to plant some lilies? No, Steve. Can I tell her about the beer? You saw a deer? Of course, Steve. Never mind. I'll get your wine. Anyway, you cook and you drink some beer, and then while you're at it, you just dump a little bit of that beer into the crack pot. That can't be sanitary. I'll bring some over to you later after we get done winterizing the camper. I don't think you need to winterize anything here. We're just doing our regular fall checklist, hun. We gotta sharpen the skis. Not necessary. Get the sleds out of the attic. Won't use those. And clean those gutters. You don't want any ice dams. Cool. I'm gonna head to the pool because that's what you can still do in the fall when you live down here. Okay, have fun. I'm gonna Google cider mills. Good luck. I can't wait for you to try an apple cider donut. Hey, Steve, look up the closest cider mill. Down the cook is going to the Buffalo Bills. Over crane out loud, the cider mill. You need a drill? No, Steve. Oh, look at them squirrels go at it. Jeez Louise, they are in love. I'll tell you what, that's nice to see. Check out our merch. Check out our book. Check out our blog. It's at theholdernessfamily.com.